this video we will be discussing how as an admin you can allow your sellers to set up a minimum order amount so that the buyers of the marketplace have to fulfill this criteria in order to do the checkout. They have to fulfill the minimum order amount for each seller to do a checkout from the marketplace. One more thing we just need to inform you that since this feature is enabled on the cart page, so if a if a buyer has fulfilled the criteria on the cart page and he is using a discount coupon on the checkout page, then he can do a checkout with a discount coupon. The order will be placed. So, in order to use this feature, we will be enabling this feature from an admin panel. Then we will be injecting the codes in the Shopify theme liquid files. Then we will be seeing on the seller panel to configure this feature and inputting the values then we'll be seeing everything on a Shopify front end. So let's go into configuration section, click on general configuration, search for this feature, allow sellers to set a minimum purchase amount for orders, enable this feature, click on save. Go into instruction for marketplace now. Let's search for the codes. So here are the codes you can see. There are around five codes that we need to inject in our Shopify theme. So this needs to be placed in cart template liquid size. So we'll be copying this and pasting it in our Shopify. So let's go into Shopify panel now. This is the Shopify panel. We are using a debut theme on our marketplace. So this is the live theme. Click on actions, click on edit code. Search for the files that's been mentioned in the instruction page. So card template liquid file. As we know that the all the themes have a different structure for different files. So if you face any difficulty in injecting the codes in your theme files, card template liquid files or whatever files mentioned in the instruction, instruction guide. So you can come on live chat and we have a dedicated team. We will help you and we'll inject the codes on your behalf. Once the codes have been injected, let's go into the seller panel and see the configuration over there. So this is one of the seller of our marketplace. Just go in configuration, configuration section, click on general configuration. You can see the settings over here. You have to enable the setting. So there's a drop down. One is for all customers and one is for specific tag customers. So the first one, all customers, we'll be using this one and uh, seeing on a front end. Then we'll be seeing for a specific tag customers as well. So this specific tag customer feature will only be visible to you if you are using our slot pricing feature app so what it does in slot slot pricing feature app it enables the it enables the admin to tag the customers like you can tag your customers vip vvip and the sellers can show different prices to different tax customers so this is this feature will only visible to you if you're using that slot pricing feature app so let's first do on the all customers one let's put the order and one purchase amount like 500 dollar make it safe let's see uh, let's see any of the product now so here's the product of that seller you can see the pricing is less than 500 dollars so let's add it to the cart So you can see since the price is less than seven hundred dollars, so it's showing a message fail, and we cannot check out. Let's make it more than five hundred dollars. So now you can see the message is pass, and the seller is this one only. So and we can easily check out now. So all customer case has been ended now. So we'll be seeing the other case. That is a specific tag customer case. So we are considering that slot pricing feature app is already being enabled in a multi-vendor app. 
Also, the course is being injected on the Shopify Theme Liquid files. Apart from that, all the configuration has been done on the admin panel. So, let's go back to the admin panel. Uh, click on configuration, then go in slot pricing configuration. So, this should be enabled and the tag should be created. Also, the tag should be assigned to the customers. So, coming back to the seller panel once again. Let's choose the other option, specific tag customer option. Let's so for let's set the purchase minimum purchase amount for VIP 500 and for VVIP let's set it like 800 and save it. So this will work completely similar to that of all customer in the front end front on the front end side. If you have any issues. So our live support is always there. You can come and you can just let us know your query. If you have any issues with the code injection, then also we have a dedicated team which will do the code injection everything on your behalf. Also, we have a complete dedicated guide and video for the slot pricing feature app also.